Hi, it's Holly Helmer, and today I wanted to show you something that's actually really simple, but it took me a while to figure it out, so I figured I might not be the only person online that might have this issue. I don't know, just a thought. So anyway, what it is, is um, I had seen other people do this where they embed their Hangout, their live Hangout, um, and then the subsequent YouTube video in an events page for a, a G Plus Hangout. And so the first thing you want to do is create an event page. And that's really simple. You go to the sidebar where it says, it says events and then follow the instructions. Um, this is one that I have made for a Hangout that I'm doing with Lori Turk tomorrow on how to mom blog episode 10. And so what I've done is, and this is what I do ahead of time, is I always create the create the event page and so it's ready um, to go. And then about 15 minutes or 20 minutes before the actual hangout starts, I go and I start the hangout. And that's just like you normally start a hangout. You go through those steps. Um, the main thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you're enabling the hangouts on air. And yep, I got it. And then you can hang out. And yes, I didn't put any makeup on tonight. Thanks for noticing. So what we're going to do now is um, we're in the green room. We're not starting the broadcast yet or anything. You have time. Nobody's watching. Um, and you're going to go above here where it says embed and click on that. But you're not going to grab the embed. That would be too easy. We're actually going to grab this URL, which is the direct URL for the YouTube. So we're going to copy that. And then we're going to go back over to our event. And so what I'm going to kind of click out of here so I can take you through the steps. So this is the event page that you set up a while back. You're going to click the edit on it. And then you're going to go over here to where it says event options. And you're going to pull that down and click on advanced. And then you're going to come down to the bottom of that where it says show additional fields. And then below um, your, your um, summary is going to come these four extra lines and you're going to add it, you're going to paste it right into the YouTube URL where it says optional. It's not optional if you want it to embed there. So then you're going to save, which I would do if this was really starting, but right now I'm going to cancel it. And what that will do is then it will create the video right here in the event page at the top and allow the people who are um, attending to actually interact below um, in the comments. So anyway, see that wasn't that hard, but it's just something that once you figure it out, it's much easier than it seems. So thanks so much.